Today on your 2018 Jeep Wrangler JL Unlimited, we're going to be taking a look at Roadmaster's Falcon 2 tow bars. Your tow bar is one of the main components required to flat tow your Jeep behind your motorhome. Some additional components you're going to need is your base plate, which is the connection point between your tow bar and your vehicle. You'll need your braking system that is installed in your vehicle to help it stop when you stop in your motorhome. You'll need your diode wiring that will transfer all the lights from your motorhome back to your vehicle so people behind you will know your intentions. And your safety cables, which supplement your tow bar so in the event of a catastrophic disconnect, it will stay connected to your motorhome, allowing you to come to a safe stop. The Falcon 2 tow bar is rated for 6,000 pounds, which is perfectly adequate to haul your Jeep behind your RV. There's a release located on each arm and it's this small button here that you can push down to allow you to retract the arms back in. This is nice if you're parked on uneven terrain where the arms can get into a bind. This can make it very difficult to disconnect the tow bar from the base plate. By releasing the arm and moving it in slightly, you can usually free up the pin, allowing it to come out. Roadmaster has a release lever tool that hooks onto your tow bar to give you some leverage to push down that button, making it easier to release because if it's really in a bind, these can be very difficult to push by hand. The tool to assist you in releasing those is sold separately, and you can pick one up here at eTrailer.com. When not in use, the tow bar can be folded upright, and the head of the bolt located here in the center will click into the release arm here. Then you can simply fold it off to the side. Then you can simply wrap up your cables, and you can drive your motor home with your tow bars connected, ready to go. One last thing I'd like to mention, the Falcon 2 here is a little bit more of an economical tow bar. Some of the more premium models do have channels that run down the sides, and this gives you a place to run your safety cables and wiring to keep it up off the road. Since our Falcon 2 here doesn't have that, I do recommend a coiled cable as the coil will help keep it up off the road, but extend long enough to connect your vehicle to your motorhome. We'll begin by hooking up our tow bar to our motorhome. I've already got it slid into our receiver here. We'll use the included pin and clip to secure it to the receiver. Just line up the hole with the hole in your hitch. We can then make our connection to the base plate on our Jeep. So we'll bring our tow bar up. Line it up with the hole in your base plate. Use the included pins, slide it through the base plate and the tow bar and secure the pin on the other side with the smaller pin that's tethered to it. We'll do this to both arms. You can then make the rest of your necessary connections, which includes your safety cables. Make sure that you cross your safety cables from side to side. So we've got the passenger side hooked up on our motor home. We're gonna connect the other end of our safety cable to the driver's side of our base plate. We'll hook up the other one in the same way just opposite. Now we're going to go from drivers to passengers. Can then hook up our wiring. The seven way connector will go on your motorhome side. And the six way connector will go on our vehicle. And lastly, hook up your braking system. They will all have a breakaway switch, so make sure you connect that. And depending on your braking system, you may have additional connections that you need to make. Now you might notice that your safety cables are pretty low and close to the ground. Now, until you place your vehicle in tow mode and take off, your tow bar won't be fully extended, so that will take up some of the slack. If you still have too much excess, you can take it and use a zip tie and secure it to one of the arms on the tow bar. I would recommend securing each cable to each arm for its corresponding side. With all of our connections made, you're ready to place your Jeep in tow mode and hit the road. And that completes our look at Roadmaster's Falcon 2 tow bars on our 2018 Jeep Wrangler JL Unlimited.